I got a little change and it changed my lifestyle. I'm just going to give myself some credit for showing up for day three. Um, today is actually very gloomy. Um, so it is rainy, but it's not raining, you know? It's just like, damn, if you're going to look like you're raining, just, just, just rain. And listen, oops, <laughs> there's not a lot to do. So whatever it is that you're doing to keep yourself productive during this time or to keep yourself feeling, um good do it you get up and you do that every single day whatever it is whatever it is and for some reason trying to do makeup is making me happy so and i have the time and so that's the thing you have the time right now to try to learn or not even master you're not gonna well it depends on how long we're in this quarantine thing and now i'm gonna just get started on my hair because like i said it is one my like mm, mm, mm. hold on it is 1 p.m. and I like to take my pictures um, before the daylight goes away because I love me some sunny pictures, okay? I know y'all probably like, what's going on with your head? Although I love my hair at this state, this is like fresh out the shower. All I did was um, yesterday I went to sleep with um, the style that I had in. I just kind of went to sleep with the ponytail. Um, and when I got up today, I took it out and just kind of let my hair um, get wet by the shower but today I am going red sis I'm going red and I'm popping shorty on my hair I considered wanting to straighten it but she's already curled so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and just do um, the top curls over and just give it some more like curly volume I kind of really like it and this is a wig I made by myself it's a unit so it's very homemade, very homegrown, but I'm going to show you guys how I put on my sis, my good sis here. So my favorite thing to do is literally just part my hair and twist it back. And my hair is thick, so I do small sections. Um, but that's pretty much what I do, and it works. You can braid if you want, but I just feel like corn rolling is so much work. And if you can't corn roll, this is a good way to get the same thing done. Alexa, play. I did this entire side already so these are just twists um, and what I did was I did oh don't mind my edges guys but I did attach them all to each other now you can do this as you go or you can do like a corn roll um, but the whole point is that you do want the braids even though they're still twists so they're a little looser you want them to be um, close to your scalp like so as close to your head as possible so your wig is kind of flat okay So oh, I'm finished twisting, braiding, whatever, um, and what I want to show you guys is to me the most important. So when I'm done, I grab both sides of the braid and I take it and I braid it all together to make, hope you can hear me, I braid it all together to make like kind of like a, a cap on my head. Boom such as so and honestly i could throw my wig on right now and go i'm not gonna do y'all like that i have a couple hours so i'm gonna go ahead and um i'm not gonna do y'all i'm not gonna do myself like that how about that sis i am not taking this down y'all like i'm not even putting on a stocking cap okay um which you know neither here or there it's your choice but i do have this hair paste here and i know it looks pink but it's very much so red and so what i do is i put it on my edges which I'll do after I take the coconut oil off because they're not friends my friend Shakira got this for me she's so sweet I was going through this phase of wanting red hair but not wanting to actually dye my hair and sis going ahead and purchased this for me so shout out to you Shakira anyway so I'm gonna use this for my eyebrows and I'm also gonna use this for my edges just to get me myself all the way together okay so I'm gonna get myself all the way together with that I have a mannequin head here it's just a styrofoam head that I use I put some tape on it I don't know this is real old school though I've had this for a while um, just until I can get something better for right now this is what I use and I put some tape on it to keep that styrofoam keep that styrofoam 
in there. Where are you going, styrofoam? I will come back to do my front on camera, but for right now, I'm just gonna go get into these curls and I'll be back. Don't miss me. So I'm back. It took me about 20 minutes or so to actually curl my hair, but I must say, now she is cute, okay? She is so cute. And I love her. I want to talk about to you guys real quickly about this thing that I've been using um, to keep my wigs intact because I do not glue the sucker down unless I get like a brand new lace front and I'm feeling the vibes I'm more than likely not going to glue it down basically just put it on it's a velcro it helps your hair stay um, in place so here goes some lace <laughs> So easy I literally just did a little bit of edges I'm not a wig queen but I can really say that like I would feel comfortable going out with this piece on my head right now with these curls and everything let me go change really quickly um and then I'll come back to do my makeup all right guys <laughs> <I'm eating. laughs> oh it's so good it's like butternut squash so good um I'm sorry I'm like why this feels so much easier today than yesterday's look but I'm just gonna have some faith and I'm gonna put some and granted I don't think my methods are the best but it just this is to prove to myself that I can do a little bit of makeup <laughs> so I'm going for like a nude look but like a dramatic nude kind of um soft glam I guess I know y'all see that. I don't know. But highlight makes me feel mad cute. Like, just waiting right there and boo, you boo see you like, damn, she's shining. Always. <laughs> this is my finished look. Again, don't judge me for not feeling shit in my whole face. I actually really didn't put a lot of makeup on. Um, in any of these videos so far so I haven't done like a full-on like oh beat my face look but I did go ahead and add some eyeliner to add some flair there and I decided to keep um my natural lashes today I kind of clumped them up I'm gonna put on my mask so you guys can see Basket. <laughs> thank you guys for buzzing through another video thank you Nats for coming here just make sure you are um <laughs> pressing subscribe it's over there or it's over here it's over there or it's over here it's over there over there over here over here one of the two um just go ahead and press subscribe and I will have some new video and some new content coming for you guys soon that was a little dramatic but you know honestly it's really who I am so Thank you guys for checking in and enjoy the rest of my vlogs. Click another video. What are you doing? Oh, I got a little change in a change in my lifestyle.